the earliest human in Europe, archaeological site of Atapuerca. Research at this archaeological site at Atapuerca in central Spain has revealed extraordinary information about European prehistoric settlement. Excavation work has been conducted here for the past 30 years. This is the leader of the team, archaeologist Udald Carbonell. Even before large-scale excavations began, he had a strong intuition that there would be important finds to be made here at Atapuerca. A team of archaeology students help him with the excavation work today. They are mostly volunteers. The excavation work only takes place between June and September. Anyone digging here is almost sure to make an interesting find. Many famous items have been already discovered here. In 1992, the skull of a human ancestor, half a million years old, was unearthed here. It was widely believed that Neanderthals were the only human species linked to modern man to evolve on the European continent. However, the skull turned out to be from an earlier period and probably belonged to a different type of human. Then a jawbone, dating from 800,000 years ago, was found. These discoveries confirmed that there were indeed other human species apart from Neanderthals in Europe. The unknown species of human which existed before Neanderthal was named Homo antecessor. A day in March 2008 became a day to remember for Udald Carbonell. A human jawbone from 1.2 million years ago was found here in Atapuerca. The find was reported around the world with a headline that read, the first European. Now archeologists are looking forward to developing the knowledge of how early humans came, lived and settled in Western Europe.